I've always had a, um, a big interest in art um, as a young child and um, when I heard about the competition I thought first competition I'll, I'll enter and I've always had this wee picture in my mind you know and it's really about um, going back as a child and the way our houses were and about um, you know we had the milk club coming up to deliver milk the bin men coming and that had to carry the bins obviously over their shoulders and stuff um, and then with the, the swing was always our playtime. Everybody wanted to have a rope and a pillow from their mum's house to swing around the lamppost. Um, so that's really where that idea came from. Again, just going back childhood, the way things were so different then than what they are now. I was quite chuffed when I was shortlisted. Um, out of the 25 people, was it? Yeah. And then it was put up there in the city hospital. So it was quite an achievement, you know, for the first time of entering a competition. It's just to get the art out there, you know, and to see what other artists are doing and getting ideas from them as well. And just basically trying to challenge myself with different parts of art and drawing and painting. When it comes to my work, it's great as well because a lot of the guys love to do art and it can be different art. But again, the clients have different abilities, so it's really adapting their abilities and what I can offer, you know, through the art. And it could be finger painting or um, just ordinary painting with a brush or um, hand prints. And again, the clay making, as it is great therapy um, and a way of engaging and finding out what they like to do and what works for them, you know. And it's a good wee way of uh, talking about it and. Um, getting different choices of different arts and topics for them.